Howdy, 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 my beautiful Aquarius. How are you doing, darling? My name is Simply Valka, and today, honey, we're going to get into your weekly tarot reading, Aquarius, for June 2022, all right? So if you enjoy this tarot reading here today, Aquarius, let me know in the comments below how this tarot reading resonates, as well as give this video a like and subscribe, all right? Because it helps me out a lot, and why not join the family, honey, all right? Uh, be, as well, Aquarius, be aware that it's important to look at your sun, moon, rising, and Venus sign to get the full spectrum of what's going down in your life, because that's how you get a better understanding when it comes the general chair readings is catering to your chart so um yeah let's just get right into this here aquarius see what the tea is for you darling all right the empress energy uh coming in here in the back of the deck for you guys here all right this is the card of fertility this is what you don't see coming towards you right now here aquarius i don't feel like you guys are aware about what it is that's being grown due to the life experiences that you're currently going through here aquarius all right right now i want to be uh telling you is to find the purpose and why it is you're going through the things that you are here i get this message of just like have patience at this time all right something that you came forward in your life all right i feel like something came forward in your life here aquarius and just as quickly as it came is as quickly as it uh went sour i feel all right it's like you saw the potential in a situation and you're just like man this feels really good i like where this is going here and then you're starting like with this three of swords it's like that's where like the disappointment comes in the pain here all right and so what spirit wants to be telling you right now where it's just like this page of cups that was unfortunately just like not turning out in the way that you had 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 hoped or had anticipated here Aquarius um what I want you to know at this time is that this disappointment that's happening is not the end of the story here you have this ace of cups coming in here where it's literally telling you it's just like but wait Aquarius there's more there's more to be excited about there's more coming towards you than what it is that you're aware about and so while yes you have this disappointment here right now like what's coming forward towards you in the next chapter Aquarius is so much more fabulous all right I made this story reference beforehand and you would think that I would remember it Aquarius but there's like this one story that I feel like y'all would would relate to where it's like there's this hunter and this falcon that would uh be together in this uh hunter and I'm paraphrasing this so if you recognize the story then let them know in the comments but it's like there's, there's this hunter that goes out hunting each day and there's a falcon that lets them know like he first first sees like a hair and the falcon's just like don't shoot at it right and then the hunter's just like okay like what the heck like i'll trust the process the next day then it's a deer and that same falcon comes in and it's just like don't shoot at it there's something better ahead right and it continues on to a buffalo and what have you up until like it leads them to this house with a beautiful woman all right and then family whatever 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 and so that's what i feel like your story is right now where it's just like you got that initial taste of like a fair uh like a hair and you're just like ooh, like this would be really satisfied like want to be really satisfying but it's a nice break from the constant uh battles and like you know just the obstacles that we have to deal with in this day-to-day -day life right and so yes you have to walk away from that hair that looked really promising you had the recipe planned out honey you're about to gordon ramsay that hair darling all right you know wait wait a little bit longer because there's going to be something better for you all right and now i don't think it's going to be a long transition day after day after day after day being teased each time aquarius all right let me clarify that all right because this ace of cups lets you know it's just like yeah that page of cups in the reverse that pain but you have this ace of cups coming in right afterwards right and so this is like your last time all right this is one of those times where uh, for you Aquarius th this has probably caused like some PTSD for you where it's just like you'll be so afraid of any good news that happens because you're just so used to the ball dropping right afterwards and like some type of disappointment happening after right uh, and it wouldn't surprise me whatsoever so let's continue on here Aquarius for you let's see what what else we got coming in this Emperor is coming right back out for you all right and then in the back of the deck here Aquarius we have here the seven of wands coming in here all right Aquarius what I want to be telling you here is just like you're going to be continuously I'm not sugarcoating this at all here Aquarius all right like I feel like if you're going to watch me you understand Aquarius that I am just not the one when it comes to just painting out rainbows and sunshine readings here you're going to be anticipating for a little bit longer here Aquarius 
I would like other like other things that challenge you all right other things that are going to be challenging you in hopes to knock you off your path here all right and that's the intent behind it is like your spiritual team is going to be laying down certain obstacles for you to go over all right for you to overcome Aquarius because it's through those obstacles that you overcome that help elevate you all right so don't fall for the traps don't fall for the distractions here all right the Empress with this Queen of Wands here anyone that has done you an injustice while you are just literally minding your own business and trying to elevate yourself Aquarius just know that your spiritual team has your back darling and that mo mother nature karma honey whatever you subscribe to your ancestors darling all right it's not my business what you subscribe to but justice is always going to be hand be handled Aquarius all right and so you don't have to be the one to carry out to justice you do not have to be the one Aquarius to let everyone else know the injustices of the world and you know what has happened all right and so that's like a main message that spirit really wants you to know Aquarius is don't be so hung up on having your side be heard because it's going to be heard your truth is going to be heard absolutely but the reason why spirit doesn't want you to be focusing in on trying to handle all these justices is because it's like for you Aquarius right now due to like again like you've had to deal with so many obstacles recently as I think I said earlier right this is a period for you in the coming days Aquarius where you're not going to be having to fight as hard you have the strength card coming in here with the two of pentacles as well as the three of pentacles for you your story that in the coming days here is was is for you where it's like the opportunities are going to be coming for you Aquarius are things where it's like you won't be able to handle all like balance all the blessings that come forward to you all the different collaborations that come forward to you the opportunities for you to have further finances all right you're not going to have to work for it and that's what spirit really wants to get clear to you Aquarius is that at this point in time with the emperor card in the reverse now is your time to feel spoiled essentially here Aquarius now is your time to feel spoiled now is your time to be calling the shots here all right you did your you did your period Aquarius of where you were like down in the muck and like really laying the groundwork all right you you were the one that was always taking responsibilities for other people's uh I wanted to say other people's sins who do with who would I think I am honey hello I'm a walking sin <laughs> but it's just like you were taking on other people's burdens you were always doing damage control just so the like just so you could keep your head above water that's where i feel like was happening where it's just like you didn't want to rock the boat too much because of your own self-preservation right because you had so much else going on that you didn't want to rock the boat you didn't want to deal with certain things here and so what spirit wants you to know is where it's just like hey darling like you have this like we have this situation handled all right um trust the process in that like justice is going to be done whatever that looks like for y'all in your personal life here all right because you're you're going to be putting all of your focus in on uh i mean essentially here Aquarius, you need to put all of your focus in on everything that you are going to be creating and uh for yourself and as well as these juggling all these opportunities that are going to be coming for you all right because you have the eight of wands here the star energy with the moon energy unexpected opportunities of movement here aquarius i wouldn't be surprised for some of you guys you have the opportunity um placed upon you to really um change your living environment i get like to travel associated for whatever the subjective is for you here all right but the eight of wands is active movement moon energy with the star card coming in as well it's like active move movement out of your comfort zone but it gets you a lot closer to uh the the things that you have been desiring all right so i feel like for a lot of you aquarius is your story is going to be one that that really resonates with um where it's just like you just continue minding your own business and everything just happens uh presents itself for you it's like you just wake up each day not really engaging in the outside noise and one day you wake up to an email from like i don't know like a school that you always wanted to go to or someone that you always wanted to work with and that type of dynamic here aquarius all right i really do get like your reading is like the epitome aquarius of just like minding your own allergies honey it's like your reading is the epitome of just literally just minding your own business aquarius and every like the the um the everything is going to just fall into place that's really what this is just like everything is handled from a spiritual level you've already laid the groundwork you've consistently worked with your spirit guides your ancestors like 
I don't know. Like, I feel like this is really like this reading itself. Aquarius is like an like a uh, an example of what it looks like to be spiritually aligned um, and really doing the work from not only a physical level, but a spiritual level, a mental, like emotional, mental level here. Like this really is just like, I mean, not to really toot y'all's horns too much, Aquarius, honey, but like y'all's reading is really like shows like what an exemplament girl I can't even say the words of how I want to be praising you guys I just want to be praising you guys on just like how y'all have been carrying yourself energetically as well as physically and never losing sight of what it is that you want to be accomplishing all right the way that you've been carrying yourself has been noted and it's going to you're gonna going to be rewarded for you maintaining this sense of um not the sense of balance but this sense of just like respect that you've carried for yourself it's not gone unnoticed and it's going to be rewarded really soon here aquarius all right so enough of that aquarius um let me just get out your oracle cards for this week your moon oracle as well as your animal oracle and see uh what's going to be coming for you in terms of that don't let your past hold you back your south node coming in here all right so this is really another card of just disengaging here and then you have the tortoise card stepping forward to you all right you're too fragmented to do whatever it takes to get on the ground here all right so this is more so of like a focus on just putting yourself back piecing yourself back together um and everything else will really just follow here aquarius don't get too hung up on the things that made you fragmented and just focus on getting yourself back together all right because whatever fragmented you in the first place karma is going to be coming after them all right aquarius so that's what the tarot reading that i have for you this week aquarius uh that i have hopefully this reading gave you some clarity and a sense of direction of what's been going on and like where your path is taking you all right aquarius if you enjoyed this tarot reading here today be sure to give this video a like and subscribe darling all right as well as if you want to book a private reading with me aquarius my website's always linked down below simply velka dot com all right next to my social medias tiktok and instagram both being simply velka as well but i until next time my beautiful aquarius i love you so much bye